Hi everybody and welcome to True Wants, where here we try to help you make that decision if it's going to change from a want to a need. If you are new to my channel, I really hope you will choose to subscribe. It's free and it's easy. It's the red button that you'll see right underneath this video. If you press it and it turns gray, you're in. It's that simple. There's also that bell beside that subscribe button that I always recommend that you press. It is called the notification bell. And what ends up happening is YouTube will notify you just once that I have uploaded a brand new video. I do upload a lot and and sometimes my videos are time sensitive, so I don't want you to miss out. So make sure to press that subscribe button, ring that bell, and you'll be in the know. Also in that same area, there is that thumbs up, and that's where you guys come in. If you enjoy the content that I make and that I make so much of it, please take a second when you arrive to hit that thumbs up. It will turn blue, the number will increase, and that's you helping True Ones get noticed on this huge platform. So I'm thanking you all in advance for that thumbs up. It truly is supporting the channel. All right. This has been the craziest day. We started off the day realizing and seeing the subscriber number that is here on YouTube. And it is blowing my mind because we just celebrated us hitting the 4,000 as well as our three year anniversary. And we had this huge two separate giveaways over eight boxes and all of that. And already we are getting at 4,500, which is blowing my mind, but it's making me so happy that so many of you are enjoying the content that I'm making and the information that I'm able to share and the excitement that we get, have together in reference to the boxes that I get on this channel and these brands as well. Also, we got the information about the Glamex, so I wanted to make sure to film that as well. So I made sure to get that up and then the doorbell rang and the Ipsy PR package arrived. On top of that, I had two other parcels that came in that I was testing out some products and they're really uh, have contacted me through uh, Instagram. And with those, uh, I was just gonna post on Instagram, but I'm so impressed with these products that uh, it's two completely different brands. I'm going to probably do some videos here to make sure that you guys know about them as well because there's some discounts on that. They're not affiliates or any of that. It's just when I fall in love with something and something really changed my day I want to make sure that you guys know about it too so make sure that you're subscribed to this channel because I try to share as much information as I can with you guys all right but also if you're not following me on uh Instagram you truly are missing out I, I really hope that you do and my name there is true once with the number two all right okay so let's get started in reference to this. So what I do on my channel is I open up everything prior to to make sure that everything in the box is in good condition. And then with the PR, they put it all in in a way that you kind of have to figure out what goes where. And sometimes they put things in the glam bag that should be a glam bag plus. So I put it out as best as I can. Some of these items are going to be duplicates for me. So I pulled out from my stash. So I'll be able to share that with you guys. And then what also uh, I found is this time around, I did some add-ons and <laughs> some of the add-ons that I chose for myself are in this uh, PR package. So that will end up being, you know, in the gifts for later when I get mine. But that's what happens, you know, when we get PR, it's just to me really exciting because I love that the channel gets recognized. However, I purchase from Ipsy, the Glam Bag, the Glam Bag Plus, the Glam X, the add-ons, the flash sales, all of that. So if we end up with duplicates in this box, then that ends up hopefully going to the giveaways, family, friends, charity, all that. So it's always an extra bonus to get it. And I love getting it at the beginning of the month because just like you, I'm so excited for this month. I was excited when we revealed the bags and then it became even better when the products got revealed as well. So I share spoilers with you. I try to share with you before I even choose for myself. So I am a girl that likes to be able to share my knowledge and share the information and go a little bit deeper into the products. But when we get a PR package, there's not that much information in here. And I'm just going to show you because a lot of these products we already went through and went through all the details on it when we did the spoilers and all of that. Okay. All right. So share in the comments down below if you think I got it right when we move around in here of what should go into which bag, because I always love when you guys share with me. So the cutest card this month says Halloween. Is that not the best? And what they wrote on this, it says ready to um, to look drop dead gorgeous this month. Welcome to Ipsy's Halloween, where we've conjured up everything you need for that frightfully flawless skin and ghoulish glam looks like a bewitching bag design that we voted for. And then there's this really cute card inside with the spider coming down. And then it brings us into the bag that I could not wait to see in person. So it has that spider web to it. 
The toggle switch is an actual spider. I am not a girl that loves spider, but this is the cutest thing I've ever seen. And then it has the uh, purple, and then they always tie it in. So the other bag is also the black, the purple. They tie all of that in together. And we go through all the inspiration on the bags uh, and the person who designs the bags. I love sharing that information with you too. This one is not lined inside, but you do see the purple from here. And the name Ipsy is on the back of this bag here. So the design is only on one side, which is this side here. Go as close to the camera so you guys can see the design. And then the little toggle here. Is that not the cutest? Just so you know, this bag is where everything starts started with me with subscription boxes. And it's where I always suggest you guys start too, because to me, this is the best deal out there. Right now, I think this will run around $15 a month, but the bag is never part of the count. They promise us five deluxe sample sizes. A lot of times they'll throw in uh, some full sizes in there, which is always an absolute bonus. But the reason I say this is the best deal out there is not so much for the products, which 100% that's what it's for. You get the bonus bag, but on top of the bonus bag, you get access to everything else Ipsy. You can upgrade from this bag. You can do add-ons, flash sales, everything that anybody does on Ipsy, the shopper, you have access to all of that with that $15 as a member, it makes you a member of Ipsy. And then you get access to everything plus the fantastic products that you get in the bag. To me, it is an absolute win-win. And it also gives you that treat once a month for $15 for you to even see if you like getting subscription boxes or these treats once a month. To me, it opened up a world that I didn't even know that I was missing. So I'm hoping that you guys get the same energy that I get every time there's some spoiler out there or something to share with you because I've had the opportunity now to try so many brands and so many brands that were so expensive that they were like brands that you read in magazines but you never had the opportunity to try and now we can. So I really enjoy the Ipsy BoxyCharm subscription box world and that's why I started the channel was to be able to share my knowledge of products because I used to pay full retail for everything and having these boxes available to us at these discounted prices are absolutely fantastic. That's why even though I get PR I still get everything that I pay for because first of all this is a treat and, and a luxury to get PR and I think it's absolutely fantastic but I like being able to get my choices and being able to share with you the same excitement because that's what I was doing before I had the channel. All right, so let's get started. All right, the first item that I think is in the glam bag is this one from First Aid uh, Beauty and they're now using abbreviation FAB, F-A-B. And this is their, their Pure Purging Mask. It's a pur purifying smooth and it says it's safe for all sensitive skin. First Aid Beauty was a brand that I got introduced to from the shopping channels and what I used to love about the shopping channels was because of the job that I had I, I was like always traveling and I was uh, it was we had a good sized business so what ended up happening was a lot of times when we were uh, in the evenings we were talking to people on you know all over the world so sometimes I had to be up at midnight sometimes three in the morning all of that so the shopping channel was something that I used to watch just to keep me awake and alive and, and learn all that but what I loved about the shopping channel was at that time it wasn't spokespeople that came on. It really was the brand uh, owners or the brand developers. It, you learned so much directly from the brand owners. And First Aid Beauty was a brand that I learned a lot about. It was one of the brands that I learned about through those channels. And what happened, they were like, almost like infomercials, but you also got to purchase the products, which is what I did. And what I thought was absolutely fantastic about this brand, it was fantastic for everybody. If you have sensitive skin, if they were the only ones I knew that were able to claim if you had eczema and uh, eczema and all of those things, you couldn't do that unless you had certification to be able to do that and mention it on TV. So I, I really, really enjoy this brand. Everything that I have tried, I have really liked. This, I didn't expect this to feel this way. There are little granules in here. So not only will this be, that's the, the purification where it's gonna pull out like a mask, you're also gonna get some form of exfoliation from this as well. And I wasn't expecting that. So I also try my best to swatch everything and show you guys so that if you're interested in this and you see this in the add-ons or it ends up being a choice item where you can pick, then at least you have a little bit more information about the products and you were able to see them up close and personal. All right, so that's the first item here. The next item that was in here was one I could not wait. I was so happy that so many people and that Ipsy now is gonna be carrying this brand. This brand is called Kapari. 
I picked up uh, one of the Trend Moon boxes and the Trend Moon box is a box that is not a subscription and they're getting a lot better now because a lot of girls that want it, they used to be like, it used to be so hard to get. Uh, it got to a point where I stopped going for that box because I don't have the time to, to you know, go at a certain time, order at a certain time. If it's, you know, go on a way, it was too much. Then it started to become really easy. So she always shows you ahead of time what's in the box and you're able to pick it up. But when Ipsy grabs the line, it makes me even happier because the deals we get from Ipsy are fantastic. And it means that the brand is going to not only show one of their products, we're going to see a lot more. So the reason I'm telling you this whole story is that's how I got introduced to this brand. It was through that box and this was the item that was in there. So this is the full size of this. So I'm going to leave this sealed up for now. This is what this is. And this is called the Ultra Restorative Body Butter and it has hyaluronic acid. And this is the Ultra Restore Body Butter, the exact same thing. So this one blew me away. I was so impressed with this product that now this brand is on my, my radar. I immediately started following them on Instagram. Everything in their packaging here is recyclable, it's clean, it's vegan. This is what the product looks like inside. It is the most moisturizing, you need so little. I've had this and I use other products. I'm not gonna say I only use this, but this is when I really wanna treat myself. It is fantastic. It is a, a thick, it, it's like a thicker cream, so it's more like a, a mixture between a body butter and a body lotion. It's not the type of body butters that I used to pick up at like the body shop and things where you really had to put your hand in and like kind of melt it to try to get it out. This is more whipped and it is the scent on this is so perfect. It, it, you, can, you can smell the, the shea butter and all of that in here. It is absolutely fantastic. And look how moisturizing this thing is. It is just, just fantastic. So, so excited. And when we went through the spoilers and this brand and this product, I told you all, grab this if you can. And yet it wasn't available to me in my choices or it would have been in my bags. And I did not see this in my add-on selections, but really happy if any of you did, you're gonna be in for an absolute, absolute treat. The next item in here was a full-size lipstick and that's what I ended up putting on. So I ended up choosing to wear this color today because it is fall. And this is, even though I live in Florida, this is fall. So this is from this brand called Basic Beauty and this is the lipstick and I don't know, and the shade is called Fall For You. And this is what how dark it looks in the tube, but it really goes on really, really nicely. So I'm gonna do one swatch so you can see how light you can go. And then I'm gonna make it a little bit deeper like I did for myself here. So that is the exact same lipstick. One is just one swipe and one is a couple of swipes. This is very moisturizing on the lips. I do not even feel like I'm wearing any lipstick. It's not bleeding, it's not doing any of that. I am really impressed with this. And once again, this is Basic Beauty. Came in the full retail packaging. So even if you're looking for gift giving, I think this is great. I love when lipsticks also come in a square uh, tube. I don't know why, I just do. And this is called Fall For You. So that is what that is there. The next item in here I also put on, it is the mascara that I am wearing. I'm also wearing the eyeshadow palette, which I'll tell you that whole story when we get there. It is, uh, this is the uh, eyeshadow and that is my mascara. I never know how to show you guys the mascara or that, but this one I did not even see and I don't even know about this. And I'm a Bare Minerals girl. I'm a girl that really loved Bare Minerals because everything about them was natural. And when you're a combo skin girl like I am, you end up, you know, acne prone and all of that. So when you're able to find foundations that you could just put on like a quick powder, it gives you coverage and you you know that you're also putting skincare ingredients in to your skin. I just fell in love when I got introduced to Bare Minerals. But this one here, I did not know about, and their brand has grown so much that now there's you know BB cream, CC creams, liquid foundations. It's a completely different brand than when they first started. But this one here was a mascara that I didn't even know, and I didn't even see this in any of my options or any of our sneak peeks. And this one is called the Maximist, and it is from Bare Minerals. They're saying it is a phytofiber volumizing mascara. And if you can see, I have very little lashes, and the, this uh, blew me away. First of all, when I open this up, I'm gonna show you. The brush on this is, I thought was gonna to be too big for my eyes, and it wasn't. Because I used one that had a big brush that was from um, Too Faced. And that was the Big Daddy or, or something like that, or Damn Daddy, I can't even remember their names. 
But that one was so large, I was like constantly, because I don't have hooded eyes, I have small eyes. And this one here is what the brush looks like on here. It has these long, long bristles to it. It grabbed all my lashes. And usually if I'm gonna use two mascaras, and I didn't, I'd use just this one so I'd be able to talk about it. I usually use the spiky one first to give me my length, and then this will give me my volume. This gave me the length and the volume. I'm really hoping I can, I'm showing you as best I can. So this is what I was blown away. So that is what the actual brush looks like. If you see this and you have an opportunity in the 3 350 section to try this mascara, which is where I tell you to try all your mascaras, because I always used to try the mascaras from Sephora. I used to buy those kits where we got all these minis in there and they were like literally really expensive or they were $10 each. We're able to pick these sizes up and they're usually even a lot bigger than the ones that are in Sephora for three, three fifty in the add-on section. And that's where you get to try so many mascaras because the brush and the formula is the same that's in the full size. And then when it becomes a choice item, you've already tried it. And so then you're able to get a 20, 30, $40 mascara as a choice item in the plus or on sale if you don't, you know, get bags and you want to, you know, wait for those sales that are in full retail, but you get to try it. And that's to me is what it's all about. So this now is a, a winner for me. This I'm going to be reaching for and so excited that this was one that I didn't even know existed. And now it is on my needs list. So this is the Maximus and it's by Bare Minerals. The next one was a brush. And a brush, sometimes we end up in this section here, in the glam bag section, and this is always full size. And these brushes are beautiful. I brought out the one, so in case you got the package like I did in a previous month where there were three brushes in there, I wanted to show you that it is a different brush that is available here. The only negative with this one is nothing is marked on the barrel. So all you have is the YC collection. It is a really nice weighted, it's beautiful how, you know, the, it goes from, you know, thicker to thin. It's easy to hold. It is weighted. The bristles on this are absolutely beautiful, but I want to show you the difference between the two. So this one, you can see it goes narrow and then it goes a little bit wider. And let me just show you this one here. So you'll know because they don't have names or numbers, it's hard to make that decision on the, if there's going to be something different. So you see how this one goes wider and then narrower, and then this one goes narrow and then fluffier. So those are the differences between the two of them. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, what I'm seeing in person. So I'm trying every angle so you guys can see what I'm talking about. But like I said, I don't know what this one is called because you know th there's no information here, but if you got the kit that had the three in them in here, like I did, uh, then this is definitely not the same. And I wanted to make sure that you know about it. And on the back of this packaging, it says made in China, but nothing is written on the barrel. It just says YC collection. So that is the a brush that came in here. So that's everything that I think we are getting in the Glam Bag. Now let's get into the Glam Bag Plus. Let me just wipe my hand off so that I'd be able to swatch the other thing and I don't overly dry my skin with that uh, fab uh, product because it is a mask that is supposed to clear out everything. So we'll do the best that we can with this. All right. Okay. All right. So this is the bag that I could not wait to see in person. And I think you guys will love it just as much. It is a really nice material. It's more like a pillowcase type of material. The Ipsy name is on the side here. It's the black with the purple. The pull tag, the pull uh, pulleys are uh, purple as well. These bags I know a lot of girls use them like I do. I put a lot of masks in here. I put hair accessories in here. I use these for a lot of different things and I just love the design and I love the creativity and I think this is absolutely fantastic. I think the bags this month, they knocked it out of the park and they usually impress me, but especially for the month of October, I think they did an absolutely fantastic job. All right, now we're gonna get into the Glam Bag Plus. Glam Bag Plus runs around $30 because of all the you know new fees and all of that. <laughs> Ironically, the first item in here is one that they chose for me under my personal account, and I'm excited to get it. And this is a fantastic brand. It's Dr. Brandt. It is a facial cleanser. And this one, what it says, it will cleanse, purify, and it will also exfoliate. So what I did with this one was I removed the safety seal so I can show you what the product looks like. And there's the safety seal that I lifted up so that I'm not struggling here on camera, because as you know, I talk directly to you, I don't edit, I don't have time. So I do my best to get all the information that's on my head out to you guys. And if there's anything that I say incorrectly or 
I think of after, I always leave it in the, I try to pin a comment uh, underneath or I leave it in the description box down below. So then this is what it looks like. So it's a gel-like consistency. There, it has a, more of a medicinal scent to it, but it's still clean scent. But it's not like one of those flowery, orangey, any of that. It's not like that at all. So Dr. Brandt, really fantastic brand. It simply says, apply on damp skin to form a rich lather. Rinse well with warm water, avoid eyes, and use AM and PM. So that's always important to know because a lot of us use our cleansers and we, it, you know, wash our eyes at the same time. I always suggest to, you know, take your eye makeup off with micellular water or eye makeup remover, whatever you're comfortable with so that you're not putting any of these harsher chemical cleansers in your eyes. The next one came uh, also is one that I own and I shared with you guys. This is one that I've used. This one I'm gonna leave in the packaging here. I pulled mine out of my stash and I pulled the actual packets that are inside here out. And this one is from Do With The Gods. These are the under eye volumizing collagen pads. I'm pretty sure it's the same thing. Yeah, absolutely the same thing. This is a metal container. I told you years ago uh, when I was a kid, this was where uh, the Band-Aid brand used to come in in this type of container. What's great about these, and I share this with you, when, when you open these up and you put them under your eyes, I, I'm gonna open this up so you'll see, because I'll, I'll use these later. This one, you can um, take it out. The, the I'm too excited. The actual product inside has a, a paper on the back and it is a strong adhesive. The other side here feels like felt. So when you remove this, you take the sticky side and then you put it right underneath your eyes. The only thing I want to suggest is that when you're taking this off, because it is really sticky, that it's fantastic that it is sticky because I'm able to walk around, do whatever I need to do and still get the treatment. Because a lot of times when you use those ones that are a little bit more gel-like, they end up sliding. This won't do that. So what you end up doing is you put this on your eyes, but when you're removing it, make sure your skin is taut and then remove it. Otherwise you're gonna be stretching your skin and that's not a great thing to do. But these are, like I said, it is a felt on this side. And then when you remove this paper on the back, there's where you'll get the stickiness. So really excited to get more of these. I'm enjoying them and I think you guys will too. This is one that I put in my add-ons. I had one of those deals and if you watch my channel, you know that if I bought $25, uh, that I got another couple of free products. I think it was a shampoo and conditioner and I can't resist those free product deals, especially when it was $25. So I was gonna treat myself to something in the $12 section. And what I ended up treating myself was this palette. So like I said, when I get mine, that will end up going into my gifts for later because uh, I'm definitely not gonna need two of these. But I put this on my eyes today and I made a great choice. So if you ended up choosing this, I think you are going to be ecstatic. What I shared with you is this brand called Element. When it was in the 3350 section, I had the opportunity to try it in the matte and the shimmer shade. And that's when I knew that if it ever came available on a full size palette, I was gonna grab it because that's how I got introduced to this brand. And I fell in love with theirs in those two shadows shades. And I said, if again, if there was a full size, I was gonna grab this. And this full size was that perfect palette that everybody will be able to enjoy. There's a little mirror on the inside here and it also came with a safety shield, but I'm just gonna put this on top here. And then I'll tell you what I ended up doing and I will definitely swatch these for you guys here. That is the perfect, perfect neutral palette. It is one that you will always use. So this is what I used all over my uh, as my base. Normally I would put an eyeshadow primer on and I didn't because I really wanted to test the actual shadows on their own. The pigmentation was as if I put a primer on. It was absolutely fantastic. There was very little kick up in the pan. This one here is, uh, this was the shade that I did all over my eyelid as if I was gonna set my eyeshadow primer. That is what I would have done. This one I didn't use, but if you have a darker skin tone, then this is, will work great for you. And this is another one that is an absolute fantastic, fantastic uh, transition shade. So this one is called Cream, this is called Latte, and this is called Hazelnut. So let me just put these here so you guys will see. I'm doing one swatch, and that is how beautiful the pigmentation is and how much is left on my finger. I was blown away. It is so perfect, it is so beautiful. So if you're not familiar with the Element brand, definitely mark it on your wants list because to me, I definitely want you to try this brand. The next one in here, I'm gonna show you here, this one is in caramel. This is what I used as my second shade in my transition. This is what I used in the corner of my eye to deepen it up a little bit called cappuccino. 
and then I put it to make it a little bit darker. I did the cold brew, and then I lined my, uh, with instead of using a liner, I used this as my eyeliner color. So let me put this one here, and then I'll do these over here. Look at that. Is that not absolutely stunning? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I have to just swatch the, um, the shimmer shade. Now, this shimmer shade, I did it first plain. It was as if I put water on it. So I said, let me see if there's a difference. If I do a little spritz of my setting spray, I did it. It looked the same on both eyes. That is how beautiful this shimmer shade was. Look at this. So this is great to put in the corner of your eyes. This is what I use always dead center in my eyes. And like I said, you're able to use every single color in a palette, makes a palette an absolute winner. And I was able to pick this up for $12 in the add-ons to treat myself. And I ended up getting treated by <laughs> Ipsy. So now one of you will end up getting treated when we have some more things to celebrate and I'll be able to put another gift together because this box is already overflowing with what we are gonna be doing as a giveaway because we just hit another milestone. So I'm gonna try to go up close through my glasses so you guys can see the colors and hopefully you can see uh, absolutely, absolutely obsessed. The next one was a treat. And this one is from Fenty Beauty and it is called Heat by Rihanna. Ironically, this was a choice in uh, FabFitFun and I was uh, a little hesitant because it was called Heat, but you do not have to worry. The kick on this is really, really nothing. It, it, you'll get a little bit and then it dissipates pretty, pretty quickly. But the color on this is really beautiful and the formula on her glosses are home runs. So I'm gonna do a little bit here so you guys can see that the color that it gives you is really, really pretty. It is that color there and it is such a pretty color. So when I was putting my makeup on and everything, I used this instead of a lip oil uh, and then I took it off to put this color on and that's how I was able to test about the stinginess to be able to share with you. And like I said, the heat on this was really, really minor and it was really fantastic. So excited that this was in here. That was an absolute treat. And then another spoiler that we went through was the from KVD. And KVD is a brand that I have been enjoying for many, many years. And this is the Tattoo Pencil Liner. And just so you know, the even though Kat Von D is no longer affiliated with this brand, her design and all of that had such an impact on the beauty community. But the company that made her products are still the ones that make these products and the name called KVD standing now for vegan. The, the name of the company is called Kendo and they make all the same products. So if you loved her products but didn't like her politics or her way of life or any of that and that was your concern, you're still going to get the same quality type of products and now you're buying it directly from the company that makes it all. So I'm really excited about that. So full retail packaging here. This one had that fantastic color to it. It was that green that we saw in the spoilers and yeah. I'm going to do one swatch there so you guys can see and then to deepen it up over there. So it's a really unique hunter green, which is really fantastic that they're starting to put some color uh, liners in here because a lot of us have so many black liners because of the subscription boxes, but you will love these gel liners. They go on smooth. You'll be able to wear them in your waterline. You'll be able to wear them if you have hooded eyes or small eyes. It won't transfer when you put your uh, eyeliner on and then you open your eyes. Sometimes if you have small eyes like I do or hooded eyes, you'll end up with that transfer and you won't have that with KVD. So I really, really love this brand. Uh, Trooper was one of my go-tos for the longest time. Their liquid one as well as their pencil. So this one I'm really excited about. And this one's called the Tattoo Pencil Liner Longwell Gel Eyeliner. And it is in, uh, it's in the green. It's called uh, Verdetta Green, F -E uh, sorry, V-E-R-D-E-T-T-A. And that is everything that they sent over in the box. So some of these we were able to share in the spoilers and go through together. Some of these were not even in my selection, let alone my add-ons. And a lot of you wrote to me back when I did my video on the second, where I shared with you everything that's gonna be my Glam Bag and my Glam Bag Plus, and then I share with you the add-ons, and I go through the add-ons in detail, that if I've had the opportunity to share the products and they were wins or misses for me, I share that with you too. 
So I try to make these informative videos so that you guys are able to make more informed decisions when you're spending your dollars because that's what I'm doing. I'm spending my dollars too. So I wanna make sure that if somebody was out there making these type of informed videos, I wouldn't have started this channel because like I said, I'm still you know working full time and it's very hard to squeeze all this in, but my passion for all of this and to make sure as, you know, women helping women, that's what life should be all about. And that's what I try to do here on my channel. So please make sure you're subscribed to this channel because the growth has been absolutely fantastic. And there's so much information that I have to share with you this month. You really will miss out if you're not subscribed. So make sure your bell is on and don't forget to give a thumbs up if you enjoy the content that I make so that others who enjoy this type of content will find it easier to find me because YouTube will take that thumbs up as a signal from you guys to have my channel shown to other people who enjoy this type of content. They just haven't had an opportunity to meet me yet. So thank you to everybody for tuning in. Like I said, I have a lot of videos that I'm going to be filming, so hopefully you'll be interested in those as well. But I am so excited for October, and I really hope that you guys are too. Take care, everybody. Continue to stay safe and well, and I'll see you all soon again in the next one. Bye for now.